Because of the controversy over nano silver, we sought the reaction of the president of the Pharmaceutical Society of Nigeria, Olumide Akintayo, uh, over the use of experimental drugs in treating Ebola patient, patients here in Nigeria. Here's what he told us. There are a number of options, there are a number of trial drugs that people are looking uh, at in, a, in this desperation we find ourselves. And um, you think of things like ZMAP, which is a serum product, and um, nano silver that you talked about. Now, in the very ideal, when, uh, if you understand what clinical studies are all about, you have animal test studies. And that's where, that's a stage all of these drugs are. They're actually being tested on animal tissues and preparations about now. And the, the norm, the protocol is that once you succeed with animals, then you begin to use human beings directly. Um, we haven't got into that stage with these trial drugs, like I said, but because of the calamity, because of the emergency, some you, you want, we have a situation that is akin to the devil and the blue, deep blue sea. So people want to take a plunge, uh, especially if there is hope that administering these products can uh, sustain life for some more years, even if it is at some uh, at, the, uh, at the risk of uh, some degenerative diseases or consequences in future. Even in healthcare, you weigh what you, there is what you call a benefit risk ratio in administering routine drugs in some clinical diseases, and I guess that's the stage we have. So if uh, that's the only option left and the client is comfortable with it, I guess we have no other option than to administer these products.